I just came back with another hit. Look at this with these diamonds on my wrist. On the ship, baby, you can't get a kiss. Kid the cup, baby, you know I do not sip. Ten on me while walking with a limp. Drip all right, just know I never. What's good, YouTube? It's boy Kari. Welcome back to another video, man. We got a reaction video. So first and so clean reaction video, man. Scroll down, leave a like, and subscribe to join the hashtag Kai family, man. I hope everybody is having an amazing Christmas and a happy new year. You know what I'm saying? And happy holidays uh, for the Christmas that's coming up. We are reacting to the nastiest girl on the internet. Not even on the internet. The nastiest girl on the freaking planet, on the earth, bro. She stinks. <laughs> Let's get into this reaction video. Let's go. What's going on, guys? It's just so you know, disclaimer. You guys are all having an my headphones aren't charged, I know, I so you're gonna be hearing uh, you my computer You have five seconds to press so. like on this video, otherwise you're gonna just have watch, bad just luck watch the for the next video and to years. It. Yeah, ready? One, two, three, oh, four, yeah. five. Ooh, hopefully you got it in time, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're gonna be telling a crazy story time about uh, basically the nastiest girl I've ever met. Okay, this was a girl I knew in middle school who actually did some of the most disgusting things I've ever seen in my entire life. And uh, overall, school, it should be an entertaining story. I'm sure you guys will enjoy listening to it. Like I said, press the like button. And without Nasty further ado, let's get into school. the video. Okay. Now, my middle school okay. and high school just had some of the weirdest kids I've ever met. I don't know if it's something in the water in Las Vegas or something, but it's like weird kids multiply at a rate exponential to the rest of the country, you know? Like everywhere else in the country, they might be two or three weird kids per hundred. But uh, where I'm from, it's like 25. So we had a huge collection of weird kids that I went to middle school with. But uh, most of them were boys. I don't know if it's just because boys are weird or whatever. Like, I, I don't really know why. Maybe being weird is just sexist. But for some reason, most of the weird people that I would be around were just dudes. And, I and I'm not really sure so why So basically what he's doing, he's just playing reason, Fortnite and telling, uh, girls, telling the story at the same time about common. the nastiest like, maybe girl. One in every ten weird people were girls. But in middle school, I think one of the weirdest people in our school was a girl. And uh, for the story, I'm going to call her Angelica just because, you know, the girl Angelica from the Rugrats was a big poo-poo head. And uh, this girl, Angelica. ironically, had something to do with poo-poo. And Angelica, Angelica was one of these people that thought she was better than everyone, you know? Like, you know those girls that are just like, hmm, I would talk to you, but I think you're a big poo-poo stupid head. Facts, I don't bro. have time for that. Facts. Like, that's Facts. the type of person she was. Except the only problem Facts. is she wasn't really smarter than anyone. One, and she was really you know, weird. You know she talked up, nobody wanting to talk to her as like, oh, she's just so much smarter than everybody that no one will understand the complexities of how her brain works, you know? But the truth of the matter is she was mean and weird. Like the type of weird, I'll, I'll never forget this. This is an example of how weird she is, okay? One time, we're sitting in English class and she just looks over and starts meowing at me. And I'm like, what are you doing? And she goes, meow, I'm a cat. You have to pet me. Meow, I'm a cat. So what? here I am in a separate right, English classroom okay. with a girl meowing. If she started doing time, that, bro, she pet her. Like that's, that's how, how you know weird they want to go But somewhere weird along females. the line, it stopped the just weird being people. weird and became school, nasty. Like, like in seventh grade, she was super obsessed with cats. She's meowing at me. You know, nothing says fun like having a child meow at you. You're just sitting there like, bro, uh, what, you know, bro? I'm trying to write this essay, but I can't with Rebecca over here okay. going meow 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 and licking my arm. But regardless, you know, people are sitting here licking me and meowing me in the middle of class. But it got weirder. In eighth grade, she stopped. Being obsessed with cats and became really, really obsessed with proving to everyone that she was hardcore. You know, I don't know what it was about her being hardcore, but for some reason she was just convinced that if she was hardcore, no one would mess with her and she would have all the friends. And what I mean by hardcore Ooh, is my pretty camera's simple. Also die, she just thought that doing extreme 10%. things was sick. So like someone would dare her to, I don't know, get in a trash can well, and down the hill, and she'd be like, "Yeah, I'll do it." Jump in a trash Watch my stream, trash, okay? I'm gonna be, gross, be going. Okay? Like, I'm gonna be streaming trash, live on YouTube, YouTube probably every other night, streaming scary in, games, you know, the the sport trash games, and stuff like and that. So make sure you do not miss a stream. Watch my live stream, bro. Was perfectly normal. It's, 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 my live stream be funny, bro. I'm gonna be playing scary games. This is crazy. I want to hop inside that, so that way. So if you didn't watch the last, the last the stream, she would do just to prove last night, make sure you go check it out. And uh, over the course of the year, it started videos. to get worse and worse and worse. So here's this girl jumping into trash cans full of trash, covering herself in garbage, and overall Ew. the nastiest person I've ever met. Like it's already kind of gross, right? Ew. But, you know, it's weird. but it gets even nastier. Like I know what you're thinking, Scrubby. Ew. How in the world does it get nastier than a girl jumping in trash can and purposely rubbing herself with trash? Well, uh, let me tell you, she started wearing how long it had been since she showered like a badge of pride. You know, she's sitting there like, I haven't showered in two weeks, and thought it was cool. This isn't, like, Ew, but that's nasty, bro. 
is let's different. Try this is like, let's try we've all hit puberty, okay? Let's try we all are definitely smelling like things that you don't want to smell. And she was just bragging about how I haven't showered in two weeks. And trust Ew. me, she smelled like it. At one point, she had to get a desk separated from the rest of the kids because no one could Because she stinks so freaking bad, sick. bro. She, she stinks. She would the fact that she hadn't showered in three weeks, which is just disgusting. I don't know weeks, what level man. of nastiness you have to achieve to think it's cool to not shower. Like, I've never gotten that. Yeah, man, I haven't showered in a week. Wow, dude, so you're telling me you smell like garbage and don't think there's a problem with it? That's a little sus. I also wonder what her parents thought. Like, yeah, she had these parents that were kind of hippy-dippy and were all about self-expression. But at a certain point, not showering isn't just self-expression, okay? Not showering is just disgusting. Bro, not showering is disgusting. You, are, you, can't, you can't debate about you that. That's nasty, bro. you not showering for weeks is self-expression, you're delusional, and you need some help. Because trust me, and, and I like, promise seriously. you this, no one wants to sit next to the kid who never showers, ever. But hey, your so hippy-dippy parents sure did a good job raising you, you know? You not showering made you really popular. That, that's sarcasm. So this girl is already pretty nasty, right? And uh, I'm sure you guys are okay. thinking, Scrubby, Scrubby, she sounds gross, but she doesn't sound like the nastiest girl to ever exist, and that is correct. Come on, wait. The nastiest girl on the internet yeah, I showered. something else. Yep. But I'm just giving I you guys showered. a backstory of how I gross showered. this girl is, okay? She didn't shower, she covered herself in trash, and on top of that, she would like straight fire foods to flex on you. Like, if you had moldy milk and, and you paid her five bucks, she would drink the moldy expired milk. Like, she was just... A really weird person who really liked oh. gross things and I don't get it okay I like being clean I like living in the 21st century where we have showers and we can do whatever we want facts. you know I'm a big fan of modern living call facts, me crazy facts, here facts, but facts. smelling like garbage is not something I want to do on a daily basis it's not my favorite thing when, when I'm sitting at home writing about what I want to do with my life not once is it not shower on the list but hey you know maybe that's the difference between us and them some people just really like that life she would uh, also, also, re really, 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 really like the fact that people were grossed out by her, you know? Like, she would raise her armpits and shove them in your face. Keep in mind, she hasn't showered for two weeks. And then, like, laugh at the fact that people would run away. Like, what do you want people to do? Sit there and sniff your pits? Yeah, no, thank you. But now, we're gonna get to the front of it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here's the deepest, darkest part of all of it. So, somewhere along 8th grade, uh, we found out that she had a YouTube channel. And I know what you're thinking. Scrubby, oh. every middle schooler had a YouTube channel and that's correct but this wasn't one of those youtube channels where you did minecraft let's plays or you know sang songs or did makeup or whatever okay. uh, what we discovered is she had a youtube channel where get ready folks recoil i will warn everybody now if you don't want to throw up in your mouth you might want to click off the video now because i'm about to tell you will gross you out she was tasting different types of animal <clears throat> excrements and was rating it like a food review channel for animal droppings, okay? I don't want to say the word because it's 100% going to get bro, demonetized. She, but like, she was eating That's that disgusting. on YouTube, posting a video of her trying it and uploading it on the internet, and people were watching it. Now, I don't know what type of videos you guys watch outside of me, okay? Bro, Honestly, I, I you know, know that, that's your own business. But what in the world do you think that type of audience is going to be? You know, I didn't know there was a huge audience out that's there. Just, for that's food. just how people are, bro, these days. They want to be like. Better disgusting. give it a listen. But she was an expert on tasting feces. That is disgusting. Are, 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 you need to brush your teeth for the next days, 37 man. years. You need to brush your teeth until your social security payments what are ready to take you out. You're telling me that you were sitting there eating feces and went, yeah, 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 this is what I want to do. I'm going to upload it and put that's, it on the internet. Nasty, Who brags pretty, about pretty that? Disgusting. Somewhere along the line, this idea popped into her head. You know, I'm eating all this animal yeah, crap. No, no Maybe I should uh, reacted, film it so, and put it on the saying. internet. That, that's what I'm people love to see, you know? Last time I was sitting there on the couch watching YouTube videos, I said, Ha, huh, I sure do wish somebody was eating animal droppings. That would be my idea of a good time. And then went in the backyard and started filming people, it. Like, in her backyard, just tasting all these different types of animal feces, not seeing anything wrong with it. She thought it was perfectly normal. So whatever, someone finds this channel and immediately it spreads across the school like wildfire. Because it's not every day you have a classmate that's kind of YouTube famous for spoilers. eating animal droppings, alright? It's just not a common occurrence. So everyone starts talking about it and she becomes embarrassed immediately. She's like, I can't I mean, believe yeah, you guys would invade my privacy. Which, okay, fair enough, maybe, maybe, maybe. But you're posting these videos publicly on YouTube of you eating animal droppings and flex the fact you Obviously, don't shower. Bro. You think anyone was surprised? Like, don't get yes. me wrong. We were concerned because I feel like that's drastically unhealthy. You know, that stuff cannot be good for your lower intestine. But you can't post something publicly on the internet and then be surprised when people find it. It's like, listen, I don't tell people that I know in real life that I'm scrubby, but when they find my channel and they're like, are you this guy? I'm not like, no, how did you find that? You've invaded my privacy. I feel upset. 
because I'm putting it publicly on the internet. You just got to accept that someone's going to see it. But whatever, she gets all mad and starts reporting people who would call her by her YouTube name to the dean's office for bullying. So obviously, after a little bit, the dean tries to figure out what's going on. So we tell the dean that she has a YouTube channel of her eating poop, and he doesn't believe us. He doesn't think serious? so. He's like, no, no, there's no way. That's she not true. Poop. So everyone who's getting sent to the dean's office is getting in trouble for bullying because we're telling her that she's a poop eater. But the truth of the matter is, that's what she was. We weren't kidding. It's so not we're all bullying, bro. She actually did that. For calling this girl poop eater. But that, that's disgusting, what she was, yo. you know? That's like going up to somebody, punching him in the <sighs> face, and then uh, stomping on their knee, and then people calling you knee stomper. Like, you did it. That's just the truth. There, it's not a lie. But whatever, we found out this girl is literally eating animal droppings on her YouTube channel, and she was offended that we thought it was weird. Like, oh, my bad. Sorry I haven't been around a bunch of people who eat animal droppings. It's not common in the animal kingdom. You're, you're not supposed to do that, okay? Like... Call me crazy for thinking that's weird, but I'm pretty sure that's confirmably weird. Anyways, after uh, eighth grade year, her and her family moved to another state, so uh, the nastiest girl on the internet with the nastiest YouTube channel I no longer saw every day. But uh, last time I checked on her, she stopped uploading about three years ago, so hopefully she got into therapy or something because whatever she was doing hopefully was not normal. Hopefully she got into therapy. Okay, my I'm nigga, sorry. hopefully she took a crazy. shower. My nigga. It is not normal to be into that. What, bro? Hopefully she you know, took a shower, bro. This is actually the nastiest girl to ever exist. And hopefully if you disagree, I'm questioning your sanity because that means somewhere along the line you went, nah, 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 seems pretty normal to me. Yes, I know someone's going to comment that we were a little mean to her after we found her channel, but come on, tell me when you What's found out somebody was eating mind? animal droppings, you wouldn't be like, you're weird for that. Come on, you little wackadoodle. On that note, guys, that's going to do it for the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to press the like button. Let me know in the comment section down below what you thought. Press the like button, subscribe. That's Today's crazy. notification shout-out goes that's to That's crazy the and one. disgusting, y'all. Hey, y'all, if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to join the hashtag Coffee Only, man. Um, I love you guys. More reaction coming soon. More bangers coming soon. And um, yeah, I'm streaming every other night. I'm streaming horror games and stuff like that. So make sure you tune into that and do not miss a single stream from your boy. You know what I'm saying? I love you guys. Road to 800, Road to 1K. It's your boy Kyrie, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.